Hey guys, I hope you're well. Welcome to this new video. I am currently in Abu Dhabi airport. I've just arrived after a seven hour flight, which is super, was super long, but it was also like, it was all right actually. Um, so I'm actually here uh, in transit for seven hours actually, uh, before heading to my next destination, which I'm gonna reveal in my next video. So uh, I hope you stay tuned for that. But uh, I thought since I'm here, I might as well like show you what it's like uh, to spend seven hours in this airport. So uh, I think the plan is uh, I probably go and uh, head to the lounge, the Etihad lounge for like a couple hours. Maybe get some shower, get some sleep, get some food, and then uh, we can check out like the stores. And we can also like uh, yeah, we like uh, walk around and see what it, what there is here. So. Uh, so uh, yeah, let, let's, uh, let's head to the lounge. So there are several lounges you can go to when you're in the airport. So here I am in Terminal 3 because I arrived with Etihad Airlines. And uh, you have like the business lounge, business class lounge, you have also other lounges. And um, if you're in the economy, you can actually buy like a ticket for free and no, you can actually buy a ticket and uh, get access to lounges if they have space. So that's what I'm going to try to do. I thought there was another lounge, but I'm going to try to go to the business one. This is class one and see if it works. I'd lo love to get like a shower maybe. So yeah, let, let's, uh, let's try. Unfortunately, that didn't work, but there's another lounge apparently I can go to. So uh, I'm going to try to go to that one because uh, it'd be nice to get like a, to chill, you know, for a couple of hours, maybe work a little bit, you know, and uh, maybe, maybe take a shower. That'd be great as well. Take a shower, work a little bit. And uh, yeah, so, so uh, I'm going to attempt to, the lady said it was next to the Hermes store. So I'm going to try to find that. So uh, see you at the lounge if I, uh, if I'm successful. <laughs> So I picked a spot and uh, later we're going to take a shower. Uh, I booked a shower in like 30 minutes. I'm going to show you what it's like and then um, maybe you can grab some food. And I think I'm going to work for a little bit and maybe because um, we're in, so I had to come to Terminal 1. Uh, this is where you can get like a, the $50 lounge access for three hours. Um, so if you are in Terminal 3, you have to walk for, it, it takes about like, 10 minutes to get here and then uh, yeah after you have you have like full access to the lounge actually there's not that many people there's a lot of people like around the buffet area but like around here where I am right now it's quite empty so I don't know if it's gonna fill up but uh yeah but uh yes if you have like um so I, I'm coming to this lounge because I'm here for seven hours but um it's like 7 8 p.m so it's a little late to go into the city but if you are here for more than seven hours and if you are here like during the day maybe maybe it's uh, worth going into the city you can get actually a transfer vi a visa uh, at the immigration actually you can pay directly over there and you can get a transfer visa i think it lasts for like one or like 14 hours or something like that and so you can go explore some of the sites like in the city so some of the great sites are the mosque, which is like one of the grand mosque, um, the most popular mosque and the biggest mosque in uh, United Emirate Arabs, Arab Emirates. You can also go to like the fairy world, uh, like theme park, fairy world theme park. You can go to other, like to, you can go to the marina and stuff like that. So these are things you can do if you if you stay here longer. But if you have like a shorter stay or if you're arriving later, um, 
it, it, it's maybe more it's, it's a little tiring to go into a city and it has to also it's a simpler to just chill at the lounge and then so so yeah so uh, i'll get back to you and i'll show you the shower when i get there and then uh i'll see you later this is what the shower the bathroom looks like so you have a vanity sink here you have a sink here with soap and you have a beautiful nice shower actually with like soap there you have a toilet which is a pretty nice you have a hairdryer you also have like complimentary like amenities and you have a towel which is here so it's uh, pretty nice so I'm gonna take a quick shower and then uh, I'll get back to you after. The shower was great and all changed. All clean, it feels so good. Actually the water, the shower is really good. So if you come here and you have like a layover, definitely take a shower, it's, uh, it's worth it. I'm gonna try to get some food and then uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna work around a little bit, work a little bit, I'm gonna work a little bit, and uh, so uh, let's go. like maybe like two hours left here so I'm gonna try to make the most of it and after uh, yeah we're gonna walk around maybe a bit yeah we'll see so see you later so I'm here besides the lounges where you can rest the airport also has quite a lot of shops from snacks to luxury items that you can check out during your layover. The airport also has a spa called Tossa Spa, which is located in Terminal 1 and 3. And you can access it before or after passport control. Uh, I didn't have time to go there, but if you do, it is recommended to have like at least like two hours free uh, so you have time and don't miss your flight. So up there, there's like a food court and like uh, there's all this foods here. So there's like breakfast food, there's like burgers, Burger King. So up here are the food courts of the airport. As you can see, there are many food options, from snacks, paninis, pizza, and more, and even like Burger King. 
So if you do not wish to stay at the lounges, which is understandable, you can still come here for a meal and just chill and wait for your flight. Hey guys, so thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this little uh, video of uh, the layover in Abu Dhabi airport. Uh, I thought it was uh, fun to make it and also it could be helpful for some of you who are also coming. So uh, yes, I'm about to board my flight in a couple minutes. So I'm gonna end the video here. Uh, but next video is gonna be super exciting because it's gonna be in a super fun destination and I'm, I can't wait to show you what I'll be doing there. So. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and to click on the little bell to activate notifications to know when I upload videos and uh, don't, forget, don't forget also to give a little like on this video and uh, see you on the next video. Bye!